If you believe my videos can help other people, please subscribe, like, and share them. Why are you praying to the Virgin Mary? Why? Also, how is she a virgin? Didn't she have other children before she died? If she had other children before she died, how can she be a virgin? Like, for instance, I am no longer a virgin. So would you refer to me as the virgin Uncle Kev? Blessed art thou, virgin Kev. No, why? Because I am no longer a virgin. Right? Think about that. Okay. I believe Mary, not the Virgin Mary, because she is no longer a virgin. I believe Mary is part of the redeemed. I believe the people who choose to live for Jesus Christ is part of the redeemed. So ultimately, she is like us. If Mary, not the Virgin Mary, if Mary is like us, why would you pray to her? Can the Virgin Mary save you? Can she Take away your sins. Did she shed her blood for you? Did she? No, Uncle Kev. If so, why are you praying to her? Why not pray to this? Why not pray to my phone? Why not pray <laughs> to this here? This can't do anything for you. This can't do anything for you. Make calls. But as in, so those things can't really do anything for you when it comes down to salvation. Mary can't do anything for you. Can she? When it comes down to salvation, no. So why pray to her? Well, Mary can probably talk to Jesus and do some favors for me. What? No. We have the Bible. Okay. Why are you praying, which I believe Mary can't do anything for us. It is between us and Jesus. Why are you praying to the Archangel Michael and the Archangel Gabriel? Why? What can they do if Jesus Christ doesn't allow. Unless they want to rebel, which I believe they won't. Like, why are you praying to these created beings? Like, why not pray to me? <laughs> like, what can I do for you, honestly? 
Like, can I save you? Can I take away your sins? No. So, it is, it would be senseless for you to pray to me. It is senseless to pray to angels and Mary and the redeemed. I think it is senseless. And I believe it is idolatry as well. Why not pray to Jesus? Why not pray to God the Father? Why not? Like, you can pray to them, right? Why? If angels are down here, if Mary is down here, and God the Father and Jesus are way up here, why would you go down, man? Can't you, like, why not try to obtain a relationship with Jesus Christ? Why not? Why not? Like, why pray to angels? What are angels? Aren't angels servants? Why are you praying to a servant? Why are you praying to someone that I believe has been redeemed? Why not pray to Peter? Why not pray to the Apostle Paul? Why not pray to John the Baptist? Pray to Jesus. Pray to God the Father. Don't take part in idolatry, please. Think about it. Let me go back to Mary. If you have kids on earth, can I call you a virgin? Now, you may think of yourself as one, but can I call you that? Like, would that be accurate? You know, like, a woman with, you know, if there is a woman with 12 kids and let's say that woman had done so many great things on this earth, can I refer to her as a virgin? I hope not, right? Like, that would not make any sense, I guess, unless her children were adopted, but I believe Mary had children with Joseph. So if that be the case, how is she a virgin? Why pray to her? We have the Bible, right? If we want good things to happen to us, Let's follow the Bible, right? Don't pray to Gabriel or Michael, angels, and, you know, stop. Honestly, well, maybe I should not say that. I was going to say something, but... Let me keep that for now. So I pray this makes sense. God bless you.